Okay, so one major thing which happens almost in every household is that parents expect us to get good marks in board exams, in JE mains as well as in JE advanced, which is practically possible for some students and it's not possible for some of the students. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel again. So this is me, Madhur Pokkana, and in this video, I will be talking about a topic which is mostly asked by every one of you, and especially in this time when our board exams are very near, and the JE preparation is also almost getting completed for the 12th class students. So in this video, I will be talking about that. With that being said, let's go. Okay, so the first thing depends on you all guys because uh, what is your target like? Is it only to crack? Uh, board exam or is it you have to crack a GA exam, GE mains or GE advanced you first have to select a particular college which you are aiming for if you are aim aiming for any IIT then your uh, focus should be on GE mains and GE advanced uh, rather than if you are focusing on any normal uh, engineering college uh, then board exam and all that is enough but by the way first thing you have to do is uh, select your college you might be having a list of all the colleges which uh, you want to go like all the list uh, first make that list if you do not have that list and then uh, once if the list is done start preparing according to the college if as I said earlier if it's an IIT then start uh, preparing for mains in advance uh, give more concentration to mains in advance let me just tell you one thing <coughs> for uh, the board exams you have pre-board exams too which uh, almost last for one and a half to two weeks that's it so you just focus to these two weeks on the pre-boards uh, once if you're confident with all the topics in the pre-boards see then board exams you won't find that much difficulty in the board exams as well uh, also one more thing is uh, while you are attempting these pre-boards uh, the subject physics and chemistry NCRT is uh, you know for CBSC NCRT is uh, very good like everything is there everything comes from the book itself so not like not from the book itself but NCRT is uh, you know is a must for all the board board exams and all that but by the way NCRT is also useful for JE mains and JE advanced too but then the only the only difference which uh, is there between the board exam and the JE mains and the JE advanced are those extra MCQ, MCQs which you solve uh, for the JE mains and JE advanced and the only difference between JE mains and JE advanced are some of the topics and the complexity of the questions which they add in the JE advanced questions so this is all the major difference here comes the main question how should I prepare for more boards and exams JE mains and JE advanced uh, okay, for board exams, NCRT for English and Physics as I said earlier and for Mathematics, I, I feel that if you are uh, confident with the J mains topics of all the Mathematics stuff, uh, you can solve any questions in board exams too, but then you have the time of pre-boards. So I suggest you all to concentrate more on the pre-board examinations because they will help you a lot for the board examination. Indirect, uh, it will also help you for the J mains advanced preparation too. Also, uh, as I said earlier, Physics and Chemistry, NCRT will help help you for three three of the exams and for maths if you focus on JE mains it will be enough for board exams uh, like you don't have to score 100 percent in uh, board exams right if you are aiming for an IIT college somewhat you know you can expect marks up to 90 to 95 percent even more than that it is good for you uh, so don't just focus on a single particular exam which is board exam also so, here is my final verdict Seeing that the final aim is uh, getting admitted in one of the best colleges in India, uh, a child at this stage might have been already knowing which type of colleges he wants to get into and based on that he needs to do the preparation, uh, whether it might be a preparation for JE main exam or the JE advanced exam. Basically, if, if a child is preparing for a JE advanced exam, uh, JE mains is just the exam which he has to get the cutoff marks for which he can uh, go ahead for the JE advanced preparation because there is a lot of overlapping between the syllabus for the JE mains and JE advanced exam there are only a few topics which you have to cover additionally in the JE mains exam so I feel that there is no extra preparation required for JE mains other than those few topics which don't happen to be in JE advanced exam so that is it for today I hope you liked the video See you guys in the next video. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel for more such videos. See you guys in the next video. Till then, peace out.